How's it going, dudes? Welcome back. Proceed to continue. Alarm! alarm! Oh, fuck me. <laughs> fuck your alarm. Double barrel to Ed. My hand. Yeah, I'll take the hand of that guy. He's a fucking good shot. The road is not safe. You kill the Nazis. Oh, yeah, go on. Here, I stay with God. We wait. For you here, uh, kill everyone. <laughs> like I said, the acting's spot on, man. Like, you know, obviously, it's not even remotely close to his first language. We haul precious cargo. We have a train to catch. Like I said, it was really good acting for like not being like his main language and shit. And this guy wasn't messing as well. He said like, if you fuck around, I'm gonna come and like find you and kill you and shit. He was not fucking about. It. I'm actually worried about this dude now. Should we go through the tunnels or straight down the road? Actually, let's have a scout around first. I'm surprised there's no goodies in that. I'm gonna go in the tunnel. Two signals detected here. Do I have any other guns? Nope, just a knife and an assault rifle. Fair enough. What's that ladder doing up there? That's a big fucking ladder. Hey, oh. Dual wield handgun. Sweet as fuck. Got a silence on that right one as well. That is a tough bag. Whatever, what, what's in there? I'm trying to... Super beton. Well, whatever. I guess it's right. It's fucking super whatever's in there. It sounds like fucking steel when you hit it. Ah, sorry. No alarm. It's nearby somewhere, man. Four meters. Three meters. It's above me, innit? I think? The fuck is it? There he is. There's one over there somewhere, isn't there? Not him. Not that guy. Ah, fuck him. I thought his hat was a pickup then. It's not. Can you get up there? You can, okay. Hmm. Should I take the minigun? I think I should. It's not the stealthiest of guns, but I think it'll be alright. Well, considering there's these fucking alarm system shit. It's alright. I was gonna say, like, considering the alarms and shit there, maybe I should take this a bit stealthier, but... Why? Oh, yep, this is a fucking new minigun as well, isn't it? 1960 version. It doesn't need to be spun up, it's pre-spinning all the time. That's cool, is that? You see... Excuse me. Somebody fucking shouted at me then. The um, the cylinder on the right there consistently spinning it. That's cool is that, man. Who's shooting at me? Like you've got a chance. Are you mad? Damn, that thing's fucking accurate. That's Back to the car. <laughs> what? Well then, that's that. Easy as that. I am not dropping this gun just so I can sprint. Absolutely no fucking chance, man. Man, I thought it would require me to do something a bit harder than that. I've got to be honest. That, that was actually quite easy. Spent half of that time fucking crouching around when I could have just blitzed in there. Blitzed in there with guns. 
Got this gun. Blitz some more. Yeah, I should've just fucking run through the door, shouldn't I? Taking it all still for... <gasps> no, I dropped my gun! Don't, don't look at me like that. I'm not in a good place at the moment. I have to drop my gun. Don't need you doing that shit as well. My gun and I dropped it over here for none of that. I, I need it. I need it. I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not leaving it behind. I carried it all the way over here. I'm not fucking leaving it. Look at it. It's flashing in the background. Look at him. Here we go, fella. Nah, it's not any faster. <laughs> you see, he was sad. He was left in distance there, just shining away, and he was sad. We had to go back and get him. But like I said, if I know I'm going to get driven over here, I dropped him over here and then re-picked him up. I say some nice mapping. It must be the same engine as um, Doom 2016, man. It's got that similar feel to it, similar look. Doesn't run as good, though. Weirdly. Oh, yeah, sorry, you want me to do something, didn't you? That would be the objective of the game. Oh, I thought it was an explosive barrel, man. Well, a crate, you know. Um... Oh, you're out of ammo, dude. Well, good job, mate. Good job. You dead? Fuck, you better be. No, 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 no. Not now, dude. Not now. Sorry, mate. Who were them goodies? I can definitely see why they made the goodies auto attracting like Hoover in uh, Doom 2016. Like I was saying before, there's a lot of fucking items in this man. So much ammo and armor and health and shit everywhere. It's borderline Elder Scrolls level. Where's the lift? Oh, not the hot wiring again! You know I'm terrible at this. Right. Oh, nice. Could've been worse. Hey, oh. Oh. I guess we're going up. Look, could've been other goodies around there, man. I don't know. Look, there's a box there and a box there. You tricked me, box. You made me feel like I was gonna open a gate or something like that, not use an elevator. Turn one? What does that mean? Like, floor one or something like that? I don't know. My German's terrible. Is that... Oh, okay. Osgang? Damn, there's some sturdy fucking cans, man. Tesla grenade? What the fuck? Oh yeah, the machine gun 1960. A detached machine gun 1960 can always be reloaded by reattaching the weapon to a turret stand. The machine gun 1960 cannot be carried in your backpack. No shit. But you can drop the weapon at any time. I got it, I got it told me that. I'd have been wondering otherwise. The Tesla grenade. A hand grenade with a high explosive EMP charge for taking out multiple enemies and creating diversions. Its magnetically charged casing will stick to nearby mechanical enemies and temporarily disable them. Remember to stay out of the grenade's blast range. I swear down this game's seem are coming. Cool as fuck, man. Train going overhead. Um, excuse me. I wonder what that sound was. Zerit Verboten. Bit less than C. Oh, I think that's an address or something, I'm not sure. Either way, it's got 101 gold, I think. I don't know. Armoury? Go on then. A 
Attach. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh, you motherfucker, dude! Gravity is actually quite kind. Uh, I feel a fair distance there. I think that would have been like lethal in Dark Souls or something. Oh no, hot wiring again. Oh, I'm getting lucky. <laughs> so bad at the hot wiring. What, 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 what? Oh, there is fucking... Not much. Can't have created that much of a fucking noise. Wait a minute. What's up in here? Either way, they seem distracted, so I'll leave them to it. I'm going over here. I think. Well, I, I know I'm going over here, but I don't know if this is the right way to go. Tell me they don't look like explosive crates, man. Anything with a red stripe on it, like a barrel or a fucking crate, is explosive usually. That's gaming law. Wait a minute. They come from here. Was this just an alternative way without using the elevator? Well, I didn't know that shit. Is there a quick nerd key? Yeah, we're at F or something before. I'm not sure. I better not try it. Way, yeah, 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 yeah. G for grenade? Ah, of course. <laughs> My gun can curl around the beam. Well, you cannot, sir. Nice. Um, excuse me. Whoa, whoa, whoa now. The yeah, fucking accuracy of the guns in Wolfenstein, man. Very fucking accurate. You get shit tons of ammo as well, you don't even need to be accurate. What's that about? Dark Soulsian weight behind that crate. Um, great even. Shh. Sneak around here. No, don't turn around yet, mate. Don't turn around yet. Little fuck. It was fucking wise to my shit, was that guy? Not smart, but he certainly knew what was going on. Hey, up signal. Right. Get that lift raised. Get going. Where is this commander? Let's just sneak around a little bit until we find where this commander is. Nah, mate. Nah. Alarm! Where is it? Full on fucking PJ time now. Nah, 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 mate. Nah, I'm in a sequence. You can't kill me. I need to find this fucking commander. I don't know where he is. Oh, goodies. Yeah, I needed that. Took a bit of damage just going, you know what, fuck this, let's just fucking slay him. Well, actually, can you break these as well? Nah, fair enough. Schlieben! What was the other one? Offnen! Schlieben and Offnen! Well, that worked out. For fucking it up, that worked out pretty well, actually. I don't know what happened there. I totally want to ride on the back, man. I want to do my best Bastion on the payload impression on the back of this fucking truck. I guess not. What? What do you want me to do it? <gasps> There's a fucking gun up there. Right. Take the goodies. Take all the fucking goodies. Get on the fucking turret. 
that was perfectly angled. I realise there's a, a fucking dog next to me. No, I didn't realise there was a dog next to me. I, Right little shit. Um, grenade! Fuck, I couldn't get off there in time. I might have ammo. It's just overheating. I can't kill this guy over here, man. There we go. I say it feels like there's somebody here, but I can't see him. Apparently, I've unlocked the fucking perk bullet feeder. I don't know what I was doing. Dog. I thought I said Santa in the background. Then I don't know what that is. Some kind of fucking red text over there or some shit. Looks like Santa. Break all those crits when I go over there. Oh no, it's just the um, the bullet impacts. Fucking hell! It's ripping bits out of the map. Now that's pretty fucking nice. Oh, there's a fucking commander somewhere, man. Couldn't tell you where. 54 meters away, apparently. Right, let's go fucking deal with him. First, I'm going to mind my work over here. Oh, very nice. Took some right chunks out of this fucking station. Oh, more mini gun time. No, oh, I can't reach it. It will not turn to the right far enough. Oh, well. You know what? Let's just fucking take it. Why is it? It's almost more accurate when you don't have it detached. That's weird. Awesome though, I ain't complaining. Where is this commander? He's over here somewhere. Yeah. BJ's a fucking monster, man. I I'm just imagining like, you know, fucking Terminator 2 fucking shit here. Just stomping through the fucking area, just minigunning anything that gets in the way. They killed the commander there? Oh yeah, did. <laughs> Oops, let me shoot him in the air, that's a bit disrespectful, but... Did you not hear this incredibly nasty fucking minigun? Oh, Miss November! Ooh, you slut! Look at that leg there! Showing her arms and everything, disgusting. Shit, I'm out of a fucking... Uh, I need a new gun! Fuck me! It took so long to get rid of the fucking gun there, bitch! It took far too long to drop that gun. Like you can't, I, I don't, I, I'm maybe mistaken, but I'm sure when you've got the, um, the minigun turret, I can't just press a key to get rid of it. I've actually got to use the mouse wheel to scroll to a weapon, which is a bit weird. Does not sound right, but I'm sure that's how it fucking goes. Well, back here again! I bet I was right near to a checkpoint there. Oh, well. I ain't gonna fuck about with it this time. It's having far too much fun though. This time, just rip the motherfucker off. It's more accurate. Jump down here. Right, you bitches. Sound the alarm, I don't give a fuck. No, 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 I'm gonna turn it for you. What the fuck is a dog? Soft turret. Well, not a turret, sorry. Um, drone. Who dares? You for a start. Bit of you. Bit of you. Well, you lucky dog. I ran out of shit. Can you just select a weapon and get rid of it? Oh, you can. Okay, cool. Take this one. Goody, goody, goody. As cool as fuck is that, you can just shoot holes and stuff. You know me, I do like to shoot holes and things. Coming for you, Commander. 
coming for you, Asher Mon. There we go, dead. See, BJ agrees. You're all fucking dead now. What's that? I don't even know. Die Geshk Geshk Geshkink? Geshink? Die Geshink Consider Himat. Oh fucking no. I, I don't think there was any involvement because like, is that a chicken? I d I don't think there was any involvement of chicken in there. I thought Geshenken was chicken. I don't know. It was it was just a dude pressed up against a lass, so I don't think any chickens are involved there, Claw. If I had to take a guess anyway. Maybe it was the man that preferred chicken. You know, he's there with this lovely lady, but actually he dreams of chicken. Maybe that's the title of the film. An epic story. Who put a health pack in the toilet? That's not where health packs go. Although to be fair, uh, I'm sorry put armor in the toilet now as well. To be fair, actually, of all things that I've found in toilets over the course of my life, health and armor is actually one of the better things. It doesn't mean chicken, it means presents. Oh, it means presents, apparently. Shit. Not the stuff that was in the toilet, the poster from before. Yeah. Something like that. There's no presents in the toilet. Although, technically, there's health and armor, so... Like I say, a superior present to usual. It's a fucking mech! It's another mech! Fucking Nazi mechs! What am I supposed to do? Throw a grenade? Oh, shit, I have one. Oh yeah, I do. What is that? Oh, it's explosive, is it? Gun! Oh, bits of armor. Is there any way of stabbing you and, like, wrecking your shit? Is it- you're not gonna blow up, are you? It's still going. What's that? What- What, what, are, you, what are you pointing at? What, what, what are you doing, mate? Well, fuck me, that was a bad grenade. Oh, it does eventually blow up. They're not too bad, actually. They ain't got shit. How do you... How, well, different grenades. Different grenade types. How do I get to a different grenade type? Hmm, I don't know. I am tr I'm, I'm trying to use a different grenade type. Silence pistol versus mech. Let's do this. Can you shoot it anywhere? Is it in the actual um, the eyeball? Let's call it. That doesn't seem good. Yeah. Okay. Goodies? Nope. That seems really close to me. Well, I wish I'd left one of these miniguns. Oh, very nice. Attach that. Rip the motherfucker off. See, we've got lightning on it now. Good shit. What? What? Where's my refill, bro? I thought you could. I thought you could fucking replenish the ammo on it. It's right next to me. And it's gonna blow up behind me. Oh my god. One fucking health. Good job, by the way, gun. Good job. I can squeeze through that. Oh, thank, thank you. I'm picking up my armor. I blew up the motherfucker. I'm gonna pick up my armor. You should fucking wait. I like that mechanic as well. When you're fighting someone with like with shit tons of armor on it, you blow the armor off, and then you can pick it up. That's good shit. 
flourishing my fucking life and shit, man. I don't know if you're gonna give me it back or not. Give me a sec. I'm coming, right? Fuck, you're worse than Hugh Laurie, man. Look, there's, there's still armor over here. Is he now maxed? Okay, now I'm coming. God, she's worse than Hugh. God, I hope she didn't fart in the trunk. I don't want to get in here. That is a big fucking coffee maker. The coffee that came out of it looked like diarrhea though, I've got to be honest. That did not look nice. Look at that shit. Good job, BJ. Can handle the Kimbo fucking assault rifles like a pro, but when it comes to making a coffee. Not even the Risling Barista can be used effectively by him. It did not look like that a minute ago. That coffee actually looks kind of like coffee now. Whereas before, like I say, it looked like fucking shit. You don't look like a Nazi BJ. Not even close, dude. Well, actually, I don't know. I guess it could be. I guess it could be, yeah. Well, this is a first. A tray of milk and coffee and shit in your um, FPS. Ah, that's a new one. Um, you could put your own coffee on the tip. What? No, you're not having my fucking coffee, man. I've never managed to fucking... The, the legends are true. In fact, the coffee's actually shaking when I shake it as well. That's pretty cool. But yeah, I, I, knew, I knew this day would... What? You're not having my coffee, mate. No, not not yet. Anyway, like, like I said, the legends are true. One of these days, you're gonna be able to able to carry a tray with coffee on it in an FPS game, and not spill it. No matter what you do, the coffee will shake around, but you can't spill it. Like I said, the legends were true. Hey, fella. Commander Engel. Come where? So lecker! Risling Barista 2000! It's so fucking lecker. Like I said, some nice mapping and shit in Wolfenstein, man. Let's give her a fucking coffee, though. Even though I, I didn't. I, I'm sure BJ wasn't getting it for her, but you know, whatever. Augenblick mal. Lassen Sie sich mal ansehen. Hmm. Well, that's what I was thinking when I said that BJ doesn't actually look very um, Nazi-like. But he does, doesn't he, really? Blonde hair, blue eyes and shit, really blue fucking eyes, so... It'd be the accent that gives him away rather than his looks. That look. Yeah, I think I got it. <laughs> You're absolutely crazy as all fuck, yeah. It was quite obvious. Fucking golden luger. Wählen Sie das Foto, das Sie erregt. Wenn Sie wissen, was ich meine. Well, it's obviously going to be the blue eyes, isn't it? Ach so. Und jetzt wählen Sie das Foto, 
das in ihnen Glücksgefühle auslöst. She's the photo that makes you happy, the butterfly or the flower. Um. I, I honestly don't fucking know, man. Butterfly? Because it looks like it's been out for a rave last night or something? I don't know. Fucking raverfly. Look on that guy's face, man, there. He's just loving this. What? Just the fact that makes you feel disgusted. Skulls? Or a spider? No, it's nothing against a spider, but skulls are not disgusting, so definitely spider. What? Yeah, I'm still gonna choose a spider, man, because skulls are cool. So, uh, I, I don't make the rules. Dude's in deep there, man. She's fucking loving it. What happens if you stay sat down for a while? Fucking great acting in this, man. Really, really fucking good. There's definitely some crazy going off there. Here we go. Resume the legendary coffee tray. See you, fella. Watch out for her, man. She's fucking weird. Just a minute, what kind of telephone number is that? 0611. Simpler times, man. Radio is verboten. What's this? What, what happened to fucking Scotland and Ireland? What, what was this like during, at some point during this alternate reality? Scotland and Ireland were peppermint bombed. Uh, that, that's all I can assume from that, you know, everywhere else is having pretty decent weather, but Scotland and Ireland, peppermint. Uh, what is that? What, what, I don't even know why it's mad like that. Hey, oh, there's some problems there. Problem for what? Oh, that. World tour begins in Berlin. Berlin, October 11, 1960. Next month, the Dynamic Four will enter the stage inside the world-famous Volkshall. Something like that. To perform music from their latest album, Das Blau You Boo. I... Yeah, you yeah, well, whatever, man. Like, you, you, you've gotten used to my pronunciation of German shit by now. It's not even remotely there. Tickets to show... Sorry, tickets to the show have already been sold out in record time. It's just phenomenal, the response we've had on this latest album, said the band's manager, Wolfgang Trapper. Die Kaffer, who got themselves into trouble last week when they forgot to thank the Fuhrer before starting their concert, had also announced that they were starring a new TV show about the adventures of a world-famous boy band. That sounds like absolute shite. I can't think of anything worse than a TV show based on the exploits of a boy band. That is absolutely fucking terrible. No, no... No, no coffee, no radios, no smoking, no dogs. Seems like a good film, does this? I don't know what it's called, but it seems like a fucking awesome movie. Alright, dude. You're not having my coffee, though. In here. 
Nah, no, just checking shit. Oh, okay then. Get inside. <laughs> right, Ansley's like, come on, come on, come on, get in there. What if we started walking away? He's got a look on her face like, what are you fucking doing, man? Okay, okay, right. Oh, okay. New limestone deposits discovered in Croatia. Zagreb, October 11, 1960. A rich deposit of limestone has been discovered a few kilometers north of Belica, Croatia. The geologist who surveyed the site uh, sorry, the ge Oh yeah, yeah, it was one. I thought it was like geologist, but no. The geologist who surveyed the site said... Uh, you know, you see, that's what threw me off before. It should be the geologist who surveyed the site say. Uh, Surely, like, the, the, the geologist who surveyed the site said is what it should be, surely. Anyway, I'm not one to um, pick over England. I, I have the most terrible of England on a good day. Anyway, the geologist who surveyed the site say that there is an abundance of the special composition of limestone that is very suitable for the manufacture of super concrete. Holy fucking shit, super concrete. The material used by the Reich architects when constructing new buildings. Is that why they're so massive? Super concrete. This could be our biggest find yet, Com commented the geologist when we rang her up yesterday. <laughs> That's a very amateurish article, is that? Yeah, yeah, when you know, we found her up yesterday, she was saying, like, it was pretty big and, you know, super concrete and all that kind of shit. That's what she said. That's the escape key, man. What, 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 what? I, I'm, I want to put down my coffee tray now. I'm, 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 wait, yeah, okay, okay, right, we'll speak to you then. William? Oh god, she says William one more time. Even BJ's, look at fucking BJ's face there, man, like, fuck. <laughs> yes. You know there's just one bed. Yes. Are you comfortable sharing? <laughs> oh shit, I guess he is comfortable sharing. Sometimes Christmas. Sometimes birthdays. Sometimes mayhem. Suffering. And death. Sometimes sex on a fucking train. Sometimes you just need to feel... Something good. The fuck? Everybody knows about it. Secret police headquarters is notorious here in Berlin. They bring prisoners inside for questioning. They torture them. They drive them back to Eisenwald prison. If they're still alive. Something's happening. There's a prison transport arriving. Come quickly! In a second, I need to explore the room, man. Calendars and shit. Some f uh, you see, th these pictures make more sense, you know, like, landscapes, sure, 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 I am uh, admiring the paintings. Like, like, landscapes and shit, I see, these make sense. I mean, they're a bit barren, but, you know, better than hawk and hare. Escaping prisoner eaten by Panzerhunden. Berlin, October 12, 1960. A prisoner trying to escape Eisenwald last week found himself in the belly of the beast when he was eaten alive by one of the guard Panzerhunden. The guards tried to pull out the prisoner from the metal jaws of the Panzerhund, but the superior superiority of Reich technology made the rescue attempt futile. The prisoner was a convicted murderer and a rapist who will certainly not be missed by anyone. <laughs> they don't fuck about with news back in there. There was no PC shit then. Oh no, here we go! Apparently, um... Uh, the picture of the hawk does get around. I still don't think it's a hawk, man. I think it's a pigeon, but there's no confirmation on that yet. But no hair, counterpart. Instead, we now have barn and hair. These are fucking great pop names, man. I should remember these names. 
Ever wanna fucking make me own pub? Hawk and hare. They're making a pickup. You find a way to get down on the roof of that prison transport bus. Well, aren't we comfortable now? And you can ride it all the way into Eisenberg prison. I go down and distract the guard. Maybe he won't see you. I can never gauge BJ's look properly. It, it's like he's always slightly confused. But kind of knows what's going off at the same time. It's weird. Damn, that looks cool as fuck. See, there he knows what's going off, but other times you look at him and he has no fucking idea what's going off. Never get a beat on the dude. Yeah, I would choose to go this way first, wouldn't I? Hey, up, hey, up. Right, don't pick in there, you fucking perv, man. I've been here before. No, it's a different room. Oh, definitely a different room. I don't recognise this artwork. Here we have Lady Striking Cow. Lady with eye patch. Uh, it looks like an eye patch anyway. Oh, oh, it's the return of goat on truck. A masterpiece. I knew that must have been like you know, a, a multiple run print of it. Like there's no way something that good could only have been done once. And a blimp. Erdman's letter. More just fucking articles and all kinds of shit around here, man. Serial killer on the loose. Murder duo suspect. October 11, 1960 in Berlin. The rush of murders which has plagued the city for the last couple of months may be the work of a degenerate murder duo. Sources close to the investigation say, So far, five people have been killed. Each victim was found dismembered and scattered throughout the sewers. Witnesses rep reports speak of two strange men, most likely mentally and physically disabled. Hmm. Yeah, I can understand... Physically disabled? He, he, they've not been caught yet, but they're mentally and physically disabled. Seems... Uh, anyway, anyway. Sorry, I, I don't know, it just seems strange there. Lurking around the crime scenes. They did not look like normal, decent Berlin folk to me, says one of the witnesses. Must have been them who did this awful thing. Like I say, like, they're going around murdering shit, and, you know, dismembering them all and scattering them fruit shit. I don't know, it doesn't seem... that disabled or up to me, you know. They ain't got any legs, Claire. Yeah, really. Well, you think... They, well, this is, this is what I mean, like, if they're mentally and physically disabled, why would they go through the effort of dismembering them and scattering them around the sewers? It seems like too much effort does that. They've got jelly of their legs. <laughs> Sorry. They've got leg jelly, apparently, says Claire. Yeah. I don't know, it just seems like unnecessarily extra fucking work, you know? Ter terrorish t fuck, it's not even all the way on the fucking page there, man. Terrorish dish chef No, that can't be right. Terror terror terrorish What does every fucking German word have to be so fucking long, man? Even the newspaper fucking headline. Um sorry Terrorish to chef. Something like that. It says Claire. Ter terrorish to chef. It says chef, it's an F on the end. It may, might be an R. I'm not sure. Ter ter Some kind of bad chain of little chef. Terrorista chef. Terrorista chef. Angriff off. It's got that fucking free in there again, man. Gripe post and stuff. Stum stum stomach. <laughs> little chef angry at the fucking Grenzer post and fucking stuff. I don't fucking know, man. I can't read that at all. I, I, I do so struggle. What was the letter? That might be in English. Anya is distracting the guards. This isn't the letter, by the way, I realise. But Anya is distracting the guards by the prison transport packed. Oh, yeah, I forgot she was doing that. Um, the tall building next to it is a secret police headquarters. If I get in there, I could find a way onto the roof of the transport vehicle. I have to stay low and make sure they don't see me. I'm sure there's a letter somewhere. Oh, yeah, see ya. Oh, I missed a letter somewhere. 
Man, that's a lot of noises this menu, man. I'm just trying to read the fucking letter. Here we go. To Father Helmut Hoffman. From, oh, uh, sorry, the Berlin Church of the Third Reich. I, I, uh, fuck, why is everything so hard to pronounce in this game? I, I, a couture. Maybe, in Peru, I don't know. Dear Father Helmut, did you know that in the mythology of the indigenous groups of Peru, the, um, Quechuan, Quechuan people, there's a figure called the Pishtaku. <laughs> Pishtaku? Pishtaku? Are, are, are you taking the Pishtaku? Or the, um, the butcher? They describe him as a white murderer. What? You have to fucking... Could it just be a murderer? It has to be a white murderer. Dressed in a poncho and a wide-brimmed hat carrying a sickle. Who extracts the fat from the bodies of the... Quichu... I'm sure I had pronounced that right a second ago. Is it... Quichuan, maybe. He kills. It may sound strange, but I think it speaks volumes of the relationship between the indigenous people of this land and the Spanish conquerors who came here long ago. I've been thinking about the Pishtaku more and more recently. I can't be saying that right. Claire lasts it every time I say it. <laughs> Sorry. With the accompanying anger brewing in my heart. A month ago, I lived close to the family of the... Quechuans? Here in the... I, I, I can't... I, I, I just can't. I am, I, I, mean, I am trying to absorb story and what is actually being said in this letter. But it's like a fucking... Every fucking second word is like a hurdle. And I spend so long trying to decipher what it's, how it's actually pronounced. That I'm forgetting what it's even talking about in the end. I, don't, I can't even... I can't even. Um, trying to convert them to the Roman Catholic faith. I become friends with the youngest child of the family, or... A boy named Hatsu. Which apparently means bird of the and Andes. Hatsu has become my guide in all things relating to the culture of the... Ketchens? Ketchens? It's quite fascinating. Even though I weep for them that they may never come to the par um, come to paradise unless they convert to the true, uh, true faith there. Two weeks ago I climbed the mountains of the Andes together with Hatsu to visit a sac sorry, visit the sacrificial ground for the... The Apus? The Apus? The mountain gods. The view from up there was breathtaking. What little breath I had left after that steep climb. I was to be an observer during this ritual to the gods, which involved the sacrifice of a llama. I was to take notes and record their strange rit rituals and the paraf... Paraf... Oh, oh, sorry, I was, I was me, me, yeah, my paraphernalia, like I said, my first fucking instinct was that it was paraphernalia, but then I was like, nah, it can't be that fucking easy. Can't be that easy knowing Wolfenstein. But no, it was paraphernalia thereof. Then our soldiers came. I remember, uh, is it a kitchen? Is that, is, is, is I never know how to fucking actually spell that. Like, I'm going to say just kitchen here. A, um, a kitchen shaman calmly walking up to the officer in charge. The officer leveled a gun at his head and shot him clean through. I shouted at them, what are you doing? And he said, stay out of this father. This is a, a sanctioned purge. They started killing indiscriminately, killing everything that walked or tried to crawl away to safety. I managed to get Hatsu to run away before one of the soldiers knocked me out with the butt of his rifle. I woke up and there were no kitchens left in, ah, uh, whatever. They were just gone. I searched for Hatsu, but I couldn't find him. Either he was found and shot, or he managed to stay hidden up in the mountains. It pains me to see all these atrocities committed by my people. I'm reminded once again of the Pishtaku. The white murderers who came here and slaughtered... Oh, sorry, the white murderers who come here and slaughter these people for their own evil purposes. Can you speak to someone, Helmut? Someone who could put a stop to this nonsense, this barbaric nonsense. It cannot go on, in the name of the Lord. I have packed my bag, brought- I was gonna do some Nelly the Elephant kind of shit there, but I'll leave it. Brought warm clothes and sturdy shoes. I've even gotten a hold of a gun for protection. Trump, Trump, Trump. <laughs> Tonight I will go into the mountains and search for my friend Hatsu, and I hope to see a new dawn when I return. Wish me luck. Your devoted friend, Father Erdman Kruger. That went well. 
Oh, here we go. We got to the fucking place it wanted me to go to. Holy shit. That's a right pipe slide. Good job. Good job, BJ. Hmm. Oh, oh, I, was, I was wondering if I could break them. Oh, it's kind of like Half-Life reminiscent around here. You know, uh, Half-Life 2, like the beginning with all the slums and shit. I got a very strong vibe of that for a second. Tough barrel. Well played, sir. Curious gadget. Useless without a battery. What's that say on there? L laser... Laser... Laser Schneider prototype. Laser Schneider? Swears? Hamburger? I have... That, that is quite cool. That's actually quite a artistic kind of hamburger poster. All square and shit like that. Surely something in here is gonna be battery powered. Well, that wasn't very difficult to find a battery. It even waypointed it. it. I don't think it needed to waypoint that. It was the only moving thing in the room and it was giving you clues to it, but yet it gave you a waypoint anywhere. Maybe I was taking too long admiring the hamburger poster. It's good. That's like fucking serious art, is that? Better than goat on truck. Well, maybe not, but... Oktoberfest. Apparently you can get beer at Oktoberfest. Who would have thought that? Oh, it's a laser cut. How do you know you didn't put it in yet? It says the battery's low, but it doesn't seem to be ticking down when I use it. It doesn't seem to be cutting anything. At all, yet. Yeah. Fair enough. Where point me, bro? Cut something around here? Use the laser cutter to cut fences. Yeah, what's that? No, that is very Half-Life. Fuck me. That's like Nazi fucking Freeman technology, is that? No, this... It, it looks like it's cutting it. Well, that's pretty cool. A except it, it, it's blocking me. But, you know, other than that, hey, hey, that's fucking awesome, is that? Actually cut the exact shape. Did it cut the exact shape? Let me... Experiment. Damn, that was actually a really good triangle for a second there. It's more like a Star Trek logo now, but whatever. Hey, that's pretty fucking cool, is that? I want more fence to cut. What else, what else can I cut? Hey. <laughs> Good shit, man. You can manage it. Oh, no way I got through that hole. Even I would struggle to get through that fucking hole. And BJ's like three times my fucking size, dude. No way. That is pretty nifty, actually. There's some pretty good, like, engine fucking stuff, like, when I was shooting, like, little chunks out of the fences and stuff with the minigun. Oh, I'm out of battery, yo! This fucking fence! Can we charge it? Oh, very good! Laser. That is a really cool engine thing, is that, man? Yeah, I'm impressed by that. Recharge it. Right now, I can go finish what I started. Um. Right. Fucker! It finished it before I wanted it finished. Well, you've ruined it now. It's going to be a jack-o'-lantern. It, it kind of looks like one. Yeah, it, use your imagination a little bit, you know. you got your eyes and your mouth here and shit like that. That's cool, is that, though? Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. I was, oh, yeah, I want to recharge my thing first. Yep, 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 fuck. There. 
Very good, very good. Man, I want to fucking laser cut more shit now. There. Well, apparently there's a, a guard somewhere. There he is. I bet, I bet, yeah, you need... Oh, there's no way he didn't hear me. Look on his face, he seems surprised, I don't know why. Say lease, man waste ne verb the heart. Oh, a fuck. Claire's impressed, I can hear it. Claire is well impressed. Oh my god. Sick. Sicker high stuff rot. What the fuck, dude? I'm just here minding my own business, trying to fucking pronounce some German over here. And I get fucking... What? Dude, I'm busy. How many guys are going to come in and interrupt me doing this, man? Sick of height stuff rot. Uh, that's the best I'm going to get, man. Is he going to come around here? Yeah, I'm, he, he's gonna get me, and then he decides not to. I'm gonna crab walk over here. Oh, you can definitely see me. This is the laziest guard I have ever seen in a game, man. And the dumbest. Could you imagine if this went down in like a film or something like that? Like, you're infiltrating a building. And uh, the guard just kind of decides to attack you and then not, and then again, and then not, and then he, all you gotta do is just walk around a desk and he's confused. Like, what is this? This is... Oh, uh, you can... You, you can shout at me all you fucking want, man, but you have the intelligence of a fucking zombie, not less than a zombie. Like, uh, it's like I was saying, a zombie was smarter than that, man. You play some Resident Evil, you get a fucking zombie that'll, like, go for you better, around a desk better than that shit. To be fair, I think a zombie's hungrier than that guy, but that was a one lazy motherfucker of a guard. What's that? What? What did, what did they get? I don't know what I got. Fair enough. I think we're good. Tough glass. Do I want anything? I, 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 I wish you only the best, puppy. I just want the goodies. That's all I want. Have we got all the goodies? I believe so. Yep, seems so. Leave him to his shower room. Good dog. I, I should have really checked around the corners first, but it's alright. Hello. Nice pants, sir. Allow me to stab them. Oh, got a perk for that as well. Scout too. What's that about? Fucking hell, I'm getting down these fucking perks here, man. Oh, displays commanders on the map, fair enough. Oh, I need to stealth kill the, um, the camp funds. So I better go back and stab the dog. Eh, hey, sorry puppy, you know. <gasps> no, 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 I want to stab the dog! No. Wait a sec. Motherfucker. Oh well, do it another time. It's not letting me out again, is it? Nah, oh well. If I catch up to that arse of a guard, I'm going to totally drop on him. It's 
I've been a proper dick to those dudes. Come on, BJ, you can do this. There we go. <gasps> Let me in the fucking tanker. Well, I guess it's just an armored car, but. Concrete for miles. I wonder if there's anything in this world worth saving. Desolation. Tyranny. Enemy of endless might. I wonder if I have any friends left standing. Fuzzy! down to it. I'll fight alone. But I promise you this. Friends, if this is where they're keeping you, I will find you and set you free. Oh, next time. Next fucking time. Good shit again so far, man. That is really good. Really fucking good. The, um, like I said, the laser cutter and shit like that, like, really good fucking engine. Like, there were no like that in fucking Doom. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's the same engine as Doom, and to be fair, you know, like... It's the same with, like, the characters and the acting and shit. I mean, to give Doom some fucking, like, slack, you know, you're not gonna have a fucking conversation with a fucking demon. It's a fucking demon. It's not gonna stand there and, like, do, do some Hugh Laurie shouting at you and stuff like that, but... And I think Doom Guy was a bit more to the point, the Doom Slayer, you know. He's not really up for, you know, cutting a nice hole in a fence. He just beats down the fucking wall. Or double jumps over it, you know, one of the two. But some really clever shit there. Really good stuff. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that, and I'll catch you next time. See you, dudes!